what is the expected number of steps taken by drunken lizard from one end of the cube to the another end of the cube hi everyone welcome back to our channel from today's question you will learn a lot about the expectation value in probability so watch till the end also consider subscribing to our channel if you are preparing for your job interviews today's question is a very interesting question and the question is suppose there is a drunken lizard which wants to go from one end of the cube to another end of the cube and the lizard can move along the edges only this is the condition now you need to calculate on an average how many edges the lizard has to walk to reach to the other end of the cube it is very important to note that in this question it is not asking the shortest path but the average number of edges right so how would you go about solving this problem but before that find out our ebook on quant interview question which have recently been asked in top firms please find link in the description box or from the pinned comment it will be very beneficial for your interview preparation now back to the question so here the lizard is at point 0 it is a starting point and the lizard wants to reach at the point number 3 which is the ending point also the lizard is drunk so what may happen is that on the first step the lizard can go from 0 to 1 and on the second step it can come from 1 to 0 so the displacement is 0 and it has covered two edges but the displacement is 0 so i have marked the corners of the cube from 0 to 3 for example 1 1 1 because from 0 it has at a one distance and 2 and 3 similarly 3 so from 0 the lizard can move any of the ones which are mentioned in the cube if lizard is at position number 1 it can move to two twos and back to zero as well right and which two will depend upon which one the lizard is currently in for example if lizard is currently on this one it can move to this two and this two but if lizard is currently at this point it can move to this two and this two right similarly if lizard is at number 2 it can move to two ones and the three and finally if the lizard is at 3 the lizard is already reached the end point right so let's assume that e of 0 e of 0 is expected number of steps taken from point 0 to reach to 3 that is what we need to calculate and e of 1 is the expected number of step to reach 3 from point 1 and e of 2 is the expected number of steps to reach to point 3 from 2 and similarly e of 3 is expected number of step to reach 3 from point 3 and e of 3 will be 0 because the lizard is already reached the point 3 now we need to calculate e of 0 right because e of 0 is expected number of edges which lizard has to take to reach point 3 from 0 how can we write e of 0 e of 0 we can write as 1 plus 1 by 3 multiply by e1 which is the three time and why we have taken uh, this 1 by 3 because each one of has the equal probability to come from 0 each one has equal probability to come from 0 that is 1 by 3 and why we have added 1 because if lizard has start walking to 1 right then he, it has already covered one edge any of the ones if lizard has gone from 0 it has covered one edge right that is where we have added this one similarly what you can do is like you can write e of 1 e of 1 it has equal probability of going to these two and this zero right that is where 1 by 3 e of 0 plus e of 2 plus e of 2 similarly you can write everything this is the set of linear equation we can solve the linear equation and we will get e of 0 to be 10 so on an average the lizard has to walk over 10 edges to reach from point 0 to Point three, which is the other end of the cube. I hope you have learned something new from this video. I will meet you on to the next one. Till then, keep learning and keep watching.